This is Rob Cairns, CEO and Chief Creator of Amazing Ideas at StunningDigitalMarketing.com, the agency that helps you fulfill all your digital marketing needs. Today I wanted to do a quick screencast on the Aveda pricing tables. So on a website, if you go to our website, it looks like this. And you'll see there's a title, some prices in blue, a couple points, and a box, and a button down at the bottom. These are Aveda pricing tables. They're really cool to do. So let's go take a look at one. This is actually our live site. This is our front page. And here's the one of the pricing tables. Let's just click on the settings. It allows you to do the styling and you can put like background color and hover over color and border divider, a heading color. We're using black. The pricing text color, we're using blue. That's this color here. The black is here. I could change that. And then the body text color is black. I prefer to use dark black. It shows up really well. Okay. And then you, and then if we go to the table, you'll see here there's three columns. One, two, three. These are these. One, two, three. In here, column one. Do you want to stand out? No. If you use the stand out, it pops that section. We've not done this on any. WordPress Design Services, these are your headings, Website Security Plan, Branding and Inside Advantage Consultant. Here they are. Okay. And do you want the dollar sign before or after the price? We put it before. And these are the starting at prices, 1,000, 600, 1,000. And on the next line, we put the word starting at. So these are starting prices. Three points, one, two, three on each one. And then we can add a button. And let's go into the add a button section. You would put the URL here, the text here. I'm not going to do one because I already have one. And then what you want to text transformation and design. You s the button size, the span, the shape. If you want an icon in the button. It's that simple. And you declare the button. And then save your page. I'm not going to save this one. And that's how you get these cute little pricing tables. So what I've actually done is I've got three in a row. One, two, three. A uh, two in a row, sorry. One, two. And the trick, and if you look, all they are is there's a space element at the bottom of it that gives a blank space. And then in the next container, I've got another pricing table. That's it. That easy in Aveda. And that literally, once you get used to it, takes about five seconds to set up. I, I'm being facetious, but a minute or two. If you had to do that in the old HTML coding way, it would take you lots of time, lots of code, and lots of effort. So try the pricing tables element in Aveda. And uh, one thing I didn't show you is how to add it. If you go to element, sorry, uh, here's pricing table. It's right here. And it comes up blank. So try the pricing table element in Aveda. It help you streamline your pricing tables. And it's Rob Cairns at Stunning Digital Marketing Com, the agency that works worldwide as we work remotely. We can fulfill all your digital marketing needs, everything from a website to PPC campaigns to consulting to inside advantage discussion. You name it. Come see us. Check us out today. Have a good day, everybody. Bye.